in today's video, I've been giving it a lot of thought, and the Rizoma Stealth mirrors that I have on the bike, I'm going to remove those and put the stock ones back on. And the stock ones are right here. Yeah, I'm running out of workspace, so I just put them on top of the, the fish tank. So these are the stock ones, so I'm gonna plug them in right um, so that those lights, uh, so that those lights blink, you know, my turn signals. Right now, the way that I have those are the, I think it's, yeah, it was Rage. I think it's Rage Cycles. And I have these ones right here for my turn signals. So I have those, I'm gonna remove those because it's using the same wiring that's underneath here. So all I'm gonna do is attach, or basically plug it back in, unplug it from there, and then put the plug back in so that those work. Remove the stealth mirrors. And I've already started, so I just unscrewed those. Um, they're 10 millimeter, so I just unscrewed those. Oh, I got one more right there. So I've got to unscrew that one, so they're 10 millimeter. So I'm gonna remove those, put the other ones back in, plug everything in as well. I, I just like the way that those look, the Rizoma Stealth mirrors with my carbon fiber and just my, my black. You know, everything is pretty much black and carbon fiber. You know, I got my suede seat there. Um, am I gonna miss some? Yeah, but I mean, as far as like safety purposes and stuff and just seeing what's behind you, it, it is hard because you're vibrating so much when you're riding, especially when you're going at high speeds. You can't really make out the image of who is it behind you. I'm talking about like cops, law enforcement. <laughs> so uh, the, uh, the the stock ones, it does give you that type of visibility, so you can you know make out the images, and you know you're not trying to you know look and see what's uh, behind you. Um, also, too, that when I when I was riding or when, when I'm riding too, and I want to see what's behind you, I'll do the chicken wing, or sometimes I will hold this just to stop the vibration a little bit more, add pressure to it so I can see the image. But right now, I'm gonna put the stock look back on. Am I gonna regret it? As far as visibility, no. As far as looks, in my opinion, yes. So let's see. So I'm just gonna uh, continue to remove those and then we'll see what it looks like with the stock ones back on. And you gotta remove these four bolts. One, two, three. Uh, which we'll already take it out. Four. The windscreen's gonna pop up, and then there's this little plate that's behind it, and then that's where the connection is. Um, also, on the stock mirrors, the wire that you're going to connect over to the motorcycle is gonna go right in there. So it's gonna go in this way, right? You're gonna put the, the mirror on, the bolt sticking out, and then just tighten it with the 10 millimeter bolts. And then the wire, of course, while you're putting it in, of course, is, is gonna go in that way, and then you'll be able to access it. I'll show that to you in one moment. Just lift this up a little bit and then this will pop right out perfect all right so after you tighten down the bolts on the mirrors there they are so after you tighten those and there's the other ones then the next step is just plugging in the turn signals so i already plugged in that one super easy it's just a wire Plug it in there, very self-explanatory. So I'll put that in there. There we go, so that one's in there. It's got a good fit. That one's in there. All 
right, and then we'll move on to the next step, which is putting on the shield, and then and then the windshield. So the, the black shield part that covers this, and then the windshield. But um, just looking at it, because I'm so used to the Rizomas, but those don't look bad. I mean, back to the stock. I mean, they, they look okay, but... Yeah, okay, so install the windshield, uh, put the five millimeter bolts back in. Wait, uh, one, two, there's only four bolts, three, four. And now the next step, well actually hold on, let me take a look at that. Ah, uh, doesn't look bad at all. I mean, I'm just noticing the lights because I came from the Rizomas and now uh, putting the stock ones back in, but Looks good. So now what I should have done was test it before I installed everything, but let's just make sure this works. All right, come on, turn signal. Oh, all right, let's see. There we go. good okay so this reinstallation of the stock side mirrors uh, was a success <laughs>